Chris from the Mobile Internet Resource Center here to show off uh, the newest toy to come to our labs. This is the Wi-Fi Ranger Sky Pro LTE Edition. So this is Wi-Fi Ranger's first attempt at integrating a cellular radio as well as their long-range Wi-Fi gear into a module that will go on the roof along with an indoor router. So this is the exact same as their existing Sky Pro pack, um, but now there's also an LTE cellular up on the roof. So let's take a look at it. We always like to share our very first impressions that means we actually sometimes have to deal with packing tape. There we go. Okay. So here is a Wi-Fi Ranger's quick start guide saying you know, keep it at least two feet away from air conditioners on the roof. And single cable coming through. And what's missing, normally Wi-Fi Rangers come with Werther's candy and that's just not here. Oh, they skimped. I don't know. That <laughs> Okay, so here is the Wi-Fi Ranger Core Router, which we have reviewed separately. It's uh, normally $159 by itself. It's a nice uh, 802.11ac um, indoor router. It is lacking in gigabit Ethernet ports. These are just fast Ethernet ports. So for, pe for people who have um, more demanding indoor networking needs, we recommend upgrading to the Go AC indoors. And that Wi-Fi Ranger doesn't sell that as a kit prepackaged, but you can buy the components separately and uh, it prices out basically. No special discount for getting the kit. And then, here we go. Let's start with the little bits here. So this is a Wi-Fi Ranger's um, DC power supply. So it actually takes your between 8 and 40 volt power from your RV. So basically wire this directly into your RV's power. It puts out 24 volt power that goes into the core and um, gives you DC power. And then you can also have an AC power supply. So you've got your choice of DC or AC power. Very nice. And now we have the Sky Pro. Um, and this actually doesn't even say anything different from the existing older Sky Pros that we've seen. The only thing you can see differently about this is if you peek under the little plexiglass cover there, you can see an LTE modem mounted right on top of the Sky Pro itself. Is that the green thing? Yeah, that little green circuit board is an LTE module. And um, it has two fabric antennas that are you can see them if you squint through the plastic these are the wi-fi antennas so dual wi-fi antennas on top and then two lte antennas inside the plastic on either side here so this having your lte radio up on the roof gets it away from all the clutter and um potentially gives you much better performance than something inside so we're going to be comparing hotspots indoors hooked up to an external antenna with this um, on the roof to begin with to see how much of a difference that makes. So that's the Sky Pro LTE kit. The total cost for the kit is uh, 569 was it? A uh, 589 with their modem. And you can also get a version of this with what they call a Yod Pod. That stands for Your Own Device Pod. Which instead of a modem in here, instead of an LTE modem, it has a USB slot and you can plug in your own modem. Um, now, a quick, few quick details about Wi-Fi Ranger's modem is you can't put your own SIM card in this at the moment. This is... Um, can oh, can't? You can put your own SIM card. It's, it's not a locked device, so you can use it on AT&T or T-Mobile. It's got the bands to support them. It's got bands 2, 4, and 12, but it is not an LTE advanced modem, so it is a few tech generations behind. It's an LTE Category 4 modem. And Wi-Fi Ranger is actually selling it with a SIM and a um, service partnership with Millenicom. So it's coming with Millenicom service, um, and then Millenicom behind the scenes uses T-Mobile. So it's a, a way, a relatively affordable way to get a T-Mobile unlimited plan up on your roof. I think it's $70 a month will be the, the price on this. The, the catch with that is it's up on your roof, so you can't take this with you away from your RV. So there's a few catches from having your cellular service up away on the roof. We're eager to see just how practical this turns out to be.